Stauffer. I play soccer. Yay! Yay! This is my boyfriend, Alex. Aww. I have three dogs, Haggis, Rigby, and Daisy. I work as a lifeguard at Refreshing Mountain Camp. One thing I really love doing is exploring abandoned places with my best friend, Caitlin Rice, like this really old school that we thought we'd get murdered at. I'm really looking forward to this year on Effort I Am. Enjoy the show. Good morning, Ephrata. I'm Zane. And I'm Lily. Today is Monday, September 28th. Please rise for a moment of silence and a pledge to the flag. The Mountaineer newspaper staff will be having its first meeting today. The meeting will be held in Mr. Jeremy Bischoff's room, room 318, after school at 3 o'clock. Anyone who is interested in writing for the school's paper is encouraged to attend. We look forward to seeing you there. This announcement is for any student who is interested in learning more about the U.S. Service Academies. You are invited to attend a virtual service academy night, which will be hosted by Congressman Lloyd Smucker on Thursday, October 15th at 7 p.m. The presentation will fe feature three breakout sessions, half an hour each, where students and parents can get in-depth information about Academy ROTC nomination process. Attending a military academy is a great way for you to pay your education bills as well as serve our country as a commissioned officer. You'll be able to check out options available through the U.S. Service Academies, West Point Naval, Air Force, Merchant Marine, and Coast Guard, and ROTC programs. Each of the service academies offers an incredible free college education worth hundreds of thousands of dollars. For more details, check your Schoology class of group. It is especially important to start this process early. Freshmen and sophomores should attend if they have any interest in one of these post-secondary options. RSVPs are due by October 9th and now over to Lily for the news. In today's news, the legendary quarterback Joe Montana saves his nine-month-old grandchild from a kidnapping attempt. This all went down in Joe Ma Montana's home in Los Angeles. The L.A. County Sheriff's Department said that after a tussle with a woman, Joe and his wife got the grandchild back. The suspect then fled the scene quickly, but not too long after she was then caught by the police and charged with burglary and kidnapping. And now over to the juniors with the lunch. Hi, Ephrata. Today is September 28th, and I'm going to tell you the lunch. We have Mountaineer cheeseburger, a hot dog and a roll, crispy chicken salad, protein pack, french fries, baked beans, and assorted fruits. On Friday, football won versus Garden Spot, 21-10. Joey Gunzenhauser had 125 yards in the air with two touchdowns thrown. Richard Greer had 72 yards on the ground, and Brock Boyer had a very timely interception along with a touchdown catch. Make sure to vote Brock Boyer as Blue Ridge Player of the Week. Girls Tennis lost a close match at CV with a doubles win from Amanda Nolt, Ashlyn Mazaki, and singles wins from Ashlyn Mazaki and Jessica Pratt. Saturday, boys soccer tied 2-2 two two at Warwick. Goals were scored by Caleb Gaston and Simon Yoder. Field Hockey won versus Mannheim Central 3-2. Annika Galen had 11 saves, Mallory Klein had a goal, and Hallie Deemer had two to beat the Lady Barons. Girls Soccer tied 1-1 versus Warwick. The lone goal was scored by Emily Widener. Today, cross country is at Lebanon. Field Hockey is home versus LS. Girls Volleyball is at Mannheim Central, and Tennis hosts Hempfield. Now back to the main desk. Are you, are you ready for this year's homecoming court? I know I am. Seniors, check your Schoology class of 2021 group to find the link to cast your vote. 
This voting is for seniors only. You have between now and Tuesday, September 29th to cast your vote. Please choose your top six candidates for this year's homecoming court. If you choose more than six individuals, your vote will not count. And finally, remember you must use your school email to vote. Marzoc 2020. Marzoc 2020. Now for profound presidential perceptions from your future president, Marzoc. A new rule should be if you ever get sucked up into a tornado, you should be permitted to keep whatever you can hold on to. Love and Rockets, Marzoc 2020. P.S. Vote for me. And remember, if you're 18 years or older, register to vote at vote.gov. Have a great day, Efforta. Have a great day, Efforta.